Hello and welcome fellow gamers, my name is Barak and this is another episode of 7 Days Today modded and we're back with Starvation Mod. And quite unfortunately, well, I am being a stupid dumb twat. The reason being is, I actually recorded a video on how I built this magnificent, magnificent ramp going into the entrance. Uh, the secure and fortified and beautiful entrance in and out. That is part of a little kiss project, but quite unfortunately just before well Maybe not just before I ran out of space on my hard drive and I Deleted it without uploading into YouTube. So yeah, that kind of a suck and actually it took me like all day Like hour and a half to build this Harry Potter magnificent beauty. Well, it's not supported over there, but we will fix this later on somehow yeah i i know that it might not be exactly as it was on the project but for now i think it will do it will levitate and it will do i hope there should be like two no there's one there's one there's one no there's two definitely there are two plates over here because they do support they do support this structure right do i have anything over here can i destroy oh crap I have quite a lot. Okay, so let me just bring all that stuff down there and we'll continue continue building and we will be doing some modification to the tunnel. We will finally put some light down there. And yeah, and we'll continue building building workshop and so on and so on and so on. Quite unfortunately the horde is coming, so that definitely sucks, but still uh, we do have a few things to do down there and even if Horde comes, it really doesn't matter since they can just suck my little finger. Yeah, basically. Okay then, so let me just bring all that stuff back home. Oh, bring me, uh, let, let me just bring all that stuff back home, uh, sort a few things out down there and then we shall continue. Okay then, so I'm back our lovely base it took me quite a bit of time because well i had to go back because i need to make quite few of the torches so i need to go back to my old base get some uh, lard or fat from over there but let's continue right so as you can see i've already moved the chemistry station to one point of the left uh, to the left and then we will move that one and uh, well i've sorted all those things in here like guns bank clothes and yeah uh, but the pro project is still changing and little kiss is always giving me good advices though i have moved that window that i actually placed incorrectly and over here i've put like full block of glass full glass uh that shower glass that, that those blocks that you can not business glass i think it is called shower glass block yeah like full glass block and yeah i've put it over there so that beautiful uh, uh praying window now is one deep um mm. and that should be a okay over here though as far as i remember i need to put and table lamps is it like so on each side of the bed by the columns yeah i think that's it now the question is can i turn them on, turn them on uh let me just see if i have available connection because as you can see this is spider-man's nightmare so let me just go and grab wiring tool those still are fucked up those connections hmm i must think about something uh, but on the other, well, I had like over there, uh, I mean paintbrush, because we, we will be test testing painting in today's episode. Nevertheless, let me just check if I can connect this one to those. I guess hmm. not. Nope, doesn't seem to work. Right, so I guess you cannot actually turn them on, those lamps over here. Also, I've connected the refrigerator with a relay, as you can see that base of... Holy shit, it takes 50 watts, god damn it! What is actually status of my generator? Let me just check it, pick it up, no, turn it on, let's go over here. Well, I have quite a lot of power in here, uh, not so much of a gas. 300, well, that's like half okay that's fair enough 
that should be okay over here i'm starting to build a fireplace though i don't know if those blocks that i've used poles are the correct one uh well little kiss wrote me that i should uh, uh, use poles at least that's what i understand from yeah the saying uh, swapek which is pole for me Probably it's wrong, but that will change over time. So over here we'll be placing some bookcases and safes and so on and so on. So it really does matter as for right now. But yeah, I think how it's gonna go. Now on the campfire we will be building, we'll be using uh, barrels, burning barrels. Though I have no idea how they are supposed to work. If they are one meter high, one meter high or two meter high can't remember now but I don't know if they will fit inside the ground if we have like one block over here and then a bad rock but that's okay that's okay we'll we'll work a few things out now what I am supposed to be testing is if you can uh, if you can uh, paint those hay bales so let's put one right over here because they are easy to be removed now I guess they won't be sticking to the roof over there that definitely sucks definitely because because there goes my plan you know i wanted to cover those things since there is a relay that block is occupied so there is really not big of a sense for me to put hmm, that one over there but nevertheless, let me just test if uh, one can paint those uh, and change them into, I don't know, for example, concrete. Okay. That one is done. Da, da, da. Oh, okay. Okay. It does seem to work. Now let me just turn this off. Oh, 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 oh. I picked it up. So it seems that you can make... Uh, with R and texture picker how did I do that ah I'm not the best paint texture is locked what do you mean whoa crap ah shit Delete! Delete, goddammit! Materials. Paint roller. Okay. Now, that definitely sucks. Yeah, now I have hay bale all over the place. Fuck. But I was able to... Ah, not E. I was able to paint it. That's for sure, or, or at least... Yeah. Ah, I will have a barn soon over here. Maybe you know what, let's just go over here. Maybe that's gonna be a bit better. Because even if I try to paint something... Why do I keep pressing E? No idea. Maybe you actually can't. Oh, no, you can. Okay, that's good. Now, we have glass, glass industrial, uh, cabinet on site, medicine cabinet... Now let's try and find concrete. Camo woodland. Concrete blocks. Concrete blocks. F quite unfortunately, grey concrete. Uh, they are still locked, but... Oh, look at that. I can actually paint those. Quite unfortunately, one layer only, but still. It's better than nothing, you know. And then I can pick it up. Okay, fair enough. Oh, I ran out of paint completely. Because I've painted over here everything. Right, can I, like, delete this? Okay, with a knee, I guess. No. Now I must correct my errors. Right. Okay, okay, fair enough. It's going rather smooth and quick. Any hay bales on the top? No. Quite unfortunately, I cannot use them. Now, the next order of business is going to be uh, putting the putting the lights into the tunnel. So, 
that room is ending over here so second block from the bottom on the height of my eyes I guess that's gonna be that one I need to remove or make like a place that will go inside and then put remove one block of uh, uh, stone over there and then put I'm gonna do that take some stones that I had over here uh, blocks and with concrete and we will fill that hole and then put inside put inside torches yes that's what, what we're gonna be doing like that and this one is supposed to look quite nice over here fair enough the question is to be honest if plates wouldn't look better okay let's do second one that's gonna be one two three four and five so that one is over here I don't know if plates instead of using full blocks if that wouldn't be better oh shit that's actually sand or, or gravel actually like that it might give some clima climatic uh, looks to it I hope if it's put on both sides so let me just do a few and then I'll get back to you quite unfortunately i've spent like most of the night well actually it is a beautiful morning as you can see well the sign sun is uh, sun is up it's 5 a.m already and i've spent most of the night putting all those concrete blocks uh, that are four apart and placed those torches in the right places right nevertheless let's go back as you can see it is nicely lit i must admit it is nicely lit so quite unfortunately I have a hole over here that leads under the mercenary camp where I will be probably spending two nights because well I'm not going to fight Horde since I have so much work to be done. But all to all it looks quite awesome, you know, that torch light though it takes so much it does lag my game quite awfully. I must rethink that, those torches and maybe some light would do even good look at that it's all dark in here and all nights nicely lit over there but it does take quite a few of my frames maybe not frames but well that's how it rolls maybe i should turn off those lights because we don't need that actually okay okay now going back to the um to the workshop so uh that work rearrangement of uh, this place will require quite some of the work to be done over here because as far as I can read I must move um, those pillars up over there let me just take all those things out and quite unfortunately I must remove that one and then place a pillar or a block of concrete I should have like plenty over here can actually take those out because I need to uh, um, I need to pick it up anyway okay good 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 so that pillar will go to the top then that one will be destroyed this I need to pick up and make some and of course make some uh, plants because we will have I don't have any oh yeah I do have and then I will have to put some plants over here move that one over there uh, so first let me just remove a few blocks a few concrete blocks that will take me quite a bit of a time and then I'll get back to you okay all that digging digging is almost done so over here I will be placing storage boxes like those over there uh, but yeah there's still one that needs to be removed and probably that one as well those two well, actually, that kind of a suck because that will require still some additional work. 
But of course that work will not go to waste. Uh, I must redo like all the section over here to hide those relays. But I will think about something. Don't you worry about that. It's gonna be nice and easy. Now also I need to move that bike petrol storage chest that I have over here. Maybe not move but relocate all the stuff that is in there. Mm, no, maybe like over there. Yeah. Uh, so let me just take all that jazz, put it in here, all those nice engines and the rest of the fuel that I have. I don't have that much, so that's really mm, kind of a bummer, you know? Uh, and I guess I'll have to go out and get some out in the wilderness. Right, that one needs to go because in this place I will be having a additional um, additional chemistry station that I've own just I just built it just a few seconds ago. I had some beakers that I took from. Uh, come on, that lag is so big because of those torches. Honestly, I don't like it. Okay, so over here is it like that? It should be. Okay, so the second chemistry station is done. Now let me just put that one in here. There will be some storage boxes on top, so that's good. Also, I will be using those wet concrete arches to make those corners look a bit of a roundish, like so. So that will add a little bit of smoothness to the design. I think, I hope. Quite unfortunately, I had to move that light and make another one. But honestly, it doesn't. It's not that big of a deal. Okay, look at that. It will start to look quite awesome after some time. Okay, so do you believe that I ran out of fuel because of all that light that I left in here for the night? So that was kind of a bummer. Now, let's turn this baby on. Pick this one up. Yeah, fortunately, it doesn't take that long to pick those up. And then I will be able to uh, move them aside and put some flowers and all that just... Oh, shit. Stupid boiler machines. Okay, okay. No worries. Because they need to be in operation for me to be open. So I am able now to pick this one up. Or am I not? Why well, I'm not able to pick it up. Well, nevertheless, I guess it will be staying here, at least for the night. Yeah, that's kind of a bummer, because that's going to be in a way, definitely. Why I can't pick this up? I can't operate it. There is fuel in here, so did something change? God damn it. Okay, let's at least finish some projects. Now, um, that workbench has to be moved and make it a little bit separated yeah, from the other workbench. I will put those um, zombie girls, not right now, I will do it later on, as soon as I will get some paintings over here, because I do believe that they look quite nice in here with those flowers and that little bit of candle light. I will do it later on, little kiss, so don't you worry about that. They will stay there. Because, you know, I am a guy and I have a bed over here and... Ooh, pretty ladies, yeah. Okay, yeah, that was kind of stupid. And now, but when I will lit that fire, that campfire or fireplace, yeah, it's gonna be so cool and nice and sticky. Oh uh, yeah, I never said anything about that. Now, why I can't... There's no power to operate this... Man. What the hell are you talking about? Does it need to be... Do I need, like, any special source of fuel for it? I'm called son of a bitch, I know it. I know it. What's wrong with it? Okay, you know what, let me just pick this one up. Put it... ...on the other side. Because that's kind of a stupid thing, you know? What's going on right now with this machine? Honestly, I can't even operate it. Okay, now I'm able, able to pick it up. I don't know if it's like, if it has to be like on the side. No idea. 
Now this machine should be facing us like that. Now right next to it I will put the boiler since that mill needs to be on the right side of the boiler. Okay, that should work now. We can just check. Yes, I can operate it. Uh, minus arm and I so need to do it. You know what? I'm so hyped about it that I will I will build that one just right now. Of course, it will take like a gazillion of years to make it because I think it is uh, yeah, five minutes of time and some electrical parts. So let me just grab those and then later on we'll be able to summon a few guys. Right. Oh crap, I completely forgot that I need to have power in here for like five minutes. Because if you don't, and you don't expect, ex um, if you don't inspect that in time, it will go away. Because you won't be able to operate that machine. So yeah, definitely uh, a thing to remember later on. Now, pl pl plotted, potted plant. One will be over here. One will be over there. And one will be right next to the chemist station. And then I can pick up those flowers and burn them into some weed. Right, yeah. So it starts to look quite nice, you know. Yeah, except for that storage and that petrol. Okay, I can pick it up and that one can be destroyed as well. Um, let me just eat something. And those drinks can spoil, so I definitely should be moving those. Uh, to my fridge which is right over there question to you guys do you have any information whatsoever if that fridge when it's connected to the power if it will still generate spoiled food i'm very curious about that because if so well that kind of a suck but nevertheless hmm. it's gonna be all good and i am getting i am having a fun time with those plants around here yeah definitely oh that needs to be switched off as well Right, okay guys, so I think that's gonna be it for today's episode. We did some modification to the base. Uh, the plan is progressing at least a little bit. Now look at that, it looks really nice. It, 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 it really does. So okay guys, that's gonna be it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment about the gameplay, subscribe to the channel if you're new and you like what you see, and I hope that we'll see each other in the next episode. Where we will continue our awesome adventure. Oh. That one is connected to those. No. Hmm. Where we will con do. When we will continue our awesome adventure with 7 Days to Die modded, Starvation mod. So, tell it easy, have fun, and happy gaming. Bye bye!